Hello, welcome back. Let's try another adventure. I've been generating worlds, as you can see. Uh, I've generated one, uh, it's kind of an island world, uh, which I like for adventure mode. No crossing oceans for me. Uh, I've turned down the number of werebeast curses to zero, uh, so there are only vampire curses. I'm going to try and get myself cursed as a vampire. Uh, what are the bizarre creatures? I could be a bark scorpion. That would probably give me a big sting. That would be sweet. Black mambas are poisonous as well, I think. <laughs> a crab man. I wonder if I can give him the clamps. That would be cool. Desert tortoise. Elephant seal. I wonder if that means I could like swim really well. Probably not. Grasshopper, man. I'm trying to find something that has, like, some kind of special ability. <laughs> Loon the man. Yeah, sounds about right. Uh, Panda man. I have the ability to sit around and eat uh, bamboo all day. Fantastic. The skunk man. I wonder if I can spray shit at people, like smelly stuff to confuse them. That'd be quite amusing. I think I might try that um, tortoise man, because then we'll have some natural armor, at least on our torso anyway. I presume so. <coughs> Excuse me. So, I could start in the incidental realm, which is a split between the north and south. The Empire of Cherishing, which is in the north, and the Laborious Intricacy, which is Elves. No, let's go with the Empire of Cherishing. That sounds lovely. Um, okay, so I'm going to be like a Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtle, I guess. Uh, so let's be tough and have endurance and some focus and willpower and I guess a bit of social awareness. Hmm. So I, my favorite weapons, I think, are the halberds, because you can stab and slash and do lots of other th nice things. So I could try picking pikemen, but then it might just give me something lame. So uh, I'll go with a hammer man. For it is hammer time. Uh, 105 points left. Okay. Uh, observer. <coughs> I should be able to swim as a... Well, it's a tortoise, though, isn't it? Can tortoises swim? Or are they just like turtles that decided to walk around on the land? I don't know. If somebody has a pet tortoise, go drop it in the bath or something. We'll find out. <laughs> no, don't do that, though. Um, let's see. Dodger. Uh, let's be good at shields and armor as well. I'm not sure if I'll be able to wear armor exactly, but uh, let's be good at reading and a good speaker as well. There we go. Well, a novice speaker. That'll do. You emerge from the wilds and blah blah blah. Uh, so where does it... Ah, it does actually tell me where I'm starting here. That's nice. So I'm starting on this blinking X. Um, caves are still visible. So we've got one up there. There's a town there, I think. Uh, there's no, there's nowhere really close to it. <laughs> so yeah, I guess we'll start here. <clears throat> He's gigantic and muscular. His scales are brown and his eyes are black. He personally thinks friendship is important and does not care about fairness. Fair enough. Or not, really. Uh, moderate need to be extravagant and uh, to be with family. Eh. Okay, I'll drink some tea while it loads. Oh, you betrayed me. Huh. There's tea leaves in that. That's lovely. Um, right, so I am a red person. Uh, that is... A Rutile Throne. It's very purple. Uh, so there's a Lord over there. Uh, a Lawgiver. Okay. Um, 
Let's ask them what kind of troubles they have. Bypass greeting. I already know who they are. Inquire about troubles. Uh, we've got beasts, criminals, bandits, skulking vermin, and bone-chilling horror. What is that? There are foul goings-on over at the Tower of Plotted Chasms. Oh. Um, directions? Uh, da, da, da. Days travel to the east. The puzzling banks founded plotted chasms. Days travel to the east. What could that be? Oh. <laughs> That's a necromancer tower. I thought it might be, but... Um, let's ask about something else, because that's... But, I mean, if I if I go get myself turned into a vampire, I can just throw right in there. It'll be fine. Uh, beasts. Let's talk about that. Uh, great beasts threatens to bring ruin upon our people. The sizzling jewels. It's a dragon. All right. Tell me where this dragon is. Far to the west. How far are we talking? That's pretty far. It seems to be on the other side of a mountain, so... Um, that's okay. So if I <clears throat> ask them... Uh, we've got other beasts worrying them, by the sounds of it. Uh, there's a midnight troll. That's a bit easier to start with. Uh, where is the Tombs of Sh Shade? A short walk to the southwest. Um, Tombs of Shade, I guess it's so short that it's not even going to show up on the map, I guess. But at least I know there's a dragon cave over there. <coughs> Excuse me. My voice is not cooperating. Okay, so we've got a few targets to uh, go with adventuring on. Um... So I've got a copper warhammer and a bronze shield and a bunch of crappy cloth clothes. All oh, right, yeah. Put my weapon away, shall we? Um, so bronze bolts, bronze shields. Uh, is all the armor going to be too big for me? A silver grazer axe, um, silver pike. Uh, yep, it looks like everything is going to be too big for me. Uh, bronze buckler. I could wear multiple shields, but, um, I'm going to put away this crutch in my backpack. Because <clears throat> they do come in useful. Yeah, they're all way too big for me. That sucks. I guess this is the, uh, whoops. Didn't want to pick up the entire chest there. I guess this is the problem with playing as um, animal people, but I just I kind of expected them to be, you know, whoops, uh, just sort of human size. If they're gonna start with, oh hello, um, So I have a human crossbowman here. I don't really want a crossbowman. They tend to run out of ammo and then uselessly bash things with their shitty crossbows. I so. uh, wouldn't mind finding some other soldiers, though. Before we go off... Right, there's someone in that room over there, so... Let's try down here. There you are. It's a crossbowman. If it's a human bowman, no. <laughs> Give me, like, someone with a sword or something. That would be useful. This is how angry I am. Interact with leather robe. Huh? <laughs> That's weird. Alright. Top on the statue. Yeah, fuck you. Fucking bowman. Look at him cowering in the corner. That's right, bitch. Uh, you still can't walk through statues if you've toppled them. Interesting. Um, nope. There's no way through there. These bloody mazes. 
What are you blabbering about? Life is, in a word, death. Long live the cause. Okay, I've started a civilization that worships death. Nice. Okay, this here is a human axeman. Greet. It is good to see you. Yes. Uh, come with me on adventures. I will agree to travel with you. Good. Uh, I don't need to topple any statues in here. It's good to know. Right. Um, so I wouldn't mind a better weapon because I've got a copper warhammer is not exactly great. Uh, I think there's some more down here, perhaps. <coughs> Crystal glass lesset hammers. Oh, that's for an instrument, isn't it? Okie doke. Uh, bronze greaves. <coughs> Come on, voice. Uh, I got another water skin there. I'm going to grab that because carrying a bit of extra water. Hey, there we go. Silver mace. Those are great. Um, part of, well, yeah, let's wear this water skin. And let's go ahead and drop, uh, let's get out my stuff, drop the warhammer, strap the bronze shield. Where is the silver mace? Okay, there we go. We have a weapon and a shield strapped to us. I can't remember how to get out of here. Ah, there we go. Um, were there stairs in here? <laughs> Some weird conversation going on in here. What? Human Axeman to Reloth. It is terrifying. Am I supposed to engage with that? You should keep your weird thoughts to yourself. <laughs> what are they talking about? Like he hasn't even said anything. I think there were stairs here. Oh, there's a hatch there. I see it. Uh it is terrifying. I am awoken to nuances of cooperation. I am very satisfied. <laughs> Fair enough. Uh, okay then. So, I think... Uh, let's look up to the north. Is that a town over there? It is a town. Uh, what's this? So we've got a hamlet. Uh, we've got a dwarven fortress over there. So yeah, I think I'm going to make... I'm going to make my way to the town in the north and get myself good and cursed. It sounds like a plan. Uh, might as well skip ahead to when I'm there. Uh, I appear to have been attacked by a bear, which is um, not ideal. My companion is somewhere behind me. Oh, jeez. <laughs> uh, where is my companion? I think they're running away in panic at the sight of a fucking bear. I don't feel safe enough to travel. I certainly don't. Let's throw an arrow at it. I struck it in the leg, tearing the muscle. That's cool. Um, I seem to be slightly faster than it. Perhaps. I'm not even sprinting or anything. Uh, let's throw another arrow at it then. Uh, that completely missed. That's nice. <laughs> I've got a feeling I'm going to need this crutch in a minute. Okay, I've hit it in the leg and it's torn over. Uh, it's fallen over. So, I don't know. What? I don't have a free grip for the... Why are the arrows in my hand? Is it because I was throwing them? Okay. Right, we've drawn the silver mace. Attacking you with grab. Let's dodge. Um, to the northwest. There we go. And just let it come towards me. It's going to be very slow because it's crawling along on the floor. Bloody hell. I took about five turns for it to get to me. Uh, so it's currently not trying to attack me, I don't think. But it will once I hit it. Uh, so I can smack it in one of its legs with my silver mace. <coughs> okay, that was bruising the muscle, but um, 
Recovering from attacking you with grab. Uh, let's see. Paw. The limbs are probably better to aim at, because if you can break a bone, then they'll just go unconscious. So let's hit it in the paw with the mace. Bruising the muscle. I guess it's a pretty tough bear. Um, okay, tricky strike on the lower body, but it would be a square hit if I got it off. Uh oh. He's caught my silver mace with his left rear leg. <laughs> um, I would like that back, please. Oh no. <laughs> the bear stole my mace. Why? Why would you do this? Uh. Attacking you with silver mace? Excuse me? <laughs> um, okay, dodge the northwest. How? You're a bear, you can't wield a mace. What are you doing? Bullshit. Hmm. Suddenly bears have opposable thumbs. Interesting. Okay, easy strike, very square. I've still got my shield. That's going to hurt a little bit. Uh, and by a little bit, I mean a little bit. He's fucking attacking me with a mace. What kind of bear is this? <laughs> okay, a square hit on the head. Um, let's make it a heavy attack. Uh, which might be a mistake, but... Okay, I bruised the muscle. Fuck. I really would like to have... Uh, a companion here. <laughs> just, alright, just keep smacking it. Uh, she's rolled away. Attacking me. Uh, let's dodge to the northwest. I'm gonna end up dodging into this pool, aren't I, at some point. Okay, now I'll throw a silver arrow. Uh, I struck it in the body, tearing the muscle and tearing the guts. That's fantastic. It looks like they're panicking now. Uh, lethal grizzly bear. It's, uh, it's on the ground, it's in pain, it's tired and nauseous, and its guts are all over the place. So I think I've got the upper hand, despite the fact that it stole my weapon. Alright, there we go. It chipped one of its bones and it's given into pain, so now I can just pummel on its head until... It fucking dies. It's gonna have a pretty tough head, though, I guess. Grizzly bear wretches. Oh my god, it's going to take a long time. <laughs> ADA. Um, actually, that's a point. Can I... Oh, I can't, um... I can just auto-attack. It will just aim for the head, because it's unconscious. I want my weapon back. Uh, I don't think there's a way of... Uh, I guess I'll just put my shield away. Well, I guess I don't need to. Uh, wrestle. Grab with left hand. Silver mace. Hooray. I think I can get it back. Gain possession. You gain possession of the silver mace. It's in my hand. Okay, so now I can hit it in the head with my mace. Uh, yeah, okay. Let's just auto-attack. Yeah, now my companion turns up. Anytime you want to join in there, fella. That's fine by me. Hey, I finally died. Okay. Uh, I'll have my silver arrows back. They definitely came in useful. Okay. Um, possibly missed some. Somewhere. There might be one still stuck in the bear, actually. Yeah. Okay. Uh, we're eating bear tonight, then, I guess. Oh, I can't butcher things with uh, a mace, apparently. But I can use my copper dagger. There we go. Um, grizzly bear meat. Five. Oh, that's very, very heavy. I guess we'll just eat it, like, right away. You're starting to feel full. You feel really full. 
Damn, just one piece of that meat is enough to weigh me the hell down. Okay, put the dagger away and strap the shit to my body and let's continue. Must move away from the river. Right, I actually stopped across this river and uh, the game was like, nah, you gotta fight a bear. <laughs> um, okay, let's sidestep a little bit so I don't hit that tree and. Oh dear, I don't think that's fast enough. Where's J? There it is. A desert tortoise man cannot jump. No. <laughs> I'm gonna have to like <coughs> cross the river the old fashioned way. Okay, um Move to downward slope, move to river. I can't remember which one to choose. I think it's river. Yeah. Okay, so I found like the shortest crossing. Um, alright, well, I can't remember, did I put, um, points into swimming? Yeah, competent swimmer, I'm not wearing any armor, so. It's fine. Hello, emus. Right, uh, so I didn't really get very far there, did I? Bloody bears. Uh, cross the river through this town. Okay, we have traveled far to the north, and we have discovered the town. General Imports. <coughs> I wonder if they would have any armor. Who's this? Traveling army. Uh, so there's the castle a bit. The Supper of Garnish. That's possibly the temple. Uh, but it might just be a restaurant or something, I don't know. I got into an argument with Reloth Blossom Hopped. I'm terribly bitter about this. Dude, that was like two days ago. Uh, what is this? Oh, it's a tavern! This is literally the first one I've seen since I started playing this version. And uh, there's somebody... The human bard is in the middle of the story of the rise of the woman of the night. Uja Grave Die as an enemy of the Armored Coalition. Emits Ring of 71. The human bard stumbles over the details. Can I... Can I heckle him? Uh, shout out to everybody. Um, da -da -da -da. Express your emotions. Annoyance. Uh... Um, improving tracking. Annoyance when caught in the rain. I was out in the rain. I'm annoyed. We reclaimed hero guards on behalf of the large band. Well done. Okay. He's still telling his story, but, uh... Oh, some shit going on in there. Can I, can I just, like, get really wasted? Is there a load of... Get river spirits. You pick up the river spirits with your right hand. <laughs> How? How did I do that? You drink the river spirits. Om nom nom nom. You're starting to feel full. You feel really full. Um, so am I inebriated right now? Uh, I'm hungry. But no, I don't think I can get inebriated in adventure mode. Sadly. I can carry around an entire bottle of uh, spirits in my... whoops. I just made myself sick. Um, let's drink some river spirits to wash it down. Mmm, I guess that was a mistake. Ooh, vomit. Yeah, this is a bit more like it, I guess. Uh, I think I can drink water to stop it, though. No? Alright. I'm just gonna cover this whole tavern and vomit then. <laughs> uh, okay. Um, Lord Consort. Uh, let's ask them about any troubles around here. Well, let's see. Okay. <laughs> That's it. They, they have no troubles. Everything is fine. It's probably because they're absolutely wasted or something. Black bronze goblet. Wow, lots of mugs and stuff. Uh, I should probably put this 
river spirits back. Seems a bit heavy. Um, I am incredibly slow at the moment. And yeah, I think it's um, I think it's because I'm so nauseous. But drink more water. Nope, <laughs> it's not helping. Uh, let's ask the bard to tell us a story or something. Maybe it'll make us feel better. Uh, human bard. Ask how a listener is feeling. Can I, uh... What's available here? I don't work here. <laughs> um, can I not ask them to... Do, 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 inquire about listener's profession? The Lord Consort has finished performing. I'm a human bard. Okay. Well, I guess, uh... Do, do, do. Make the band or... No? Okay, I guess I can't specifically ask them to perform something, but... Yeah, somewhere around here is a temple, I think. That looks a bit temple-y, doesn't it? Uh, lots of columns. And... Salt piece of block walls. And some furrowed sand and stuff around it. How do I get in there? <clears throat> what are you blabbering about now? A great breach. I thought it said threatens to bring rain upon our people then, <laughs> rather than ruin. Okay. Uh, so this is a statue of a giant porcupine, giant spider, a goat. That seems fitting. Let's sacrifice the goat statue. You have been cursed by the way of trades. Okay. So since there are only vampire curses in this game, uh, I'm suddenly not nauseous anymore. I'm also a lot faster. Oh yeah, you see this over here, over to the right. Yeah, I'm a vampire now. <laughs> nice. Um, so yeah, who's this? It would appear to be a human animal dissector. Fair enough. Um, so. I guess I could just go have a bit of fun with the Necromancer Tower now. Uh, it's going to take a minute to get down there, but... You know, I'm a vampire. <laughs> I don't... I don't uh, get tired or hungry or anything like that, so... Oh, there's something... Black Bear! Where is it? Oh, I see it. I also see lots of things off in the distance. Um, well, okay. My companion is actually joining in, which is nice. Um, oh my god, uh, the black bear's knocked some of his teeth out. Can it all end so quick? Be gone, fear. No, not the... Where did the bear go? Did you kill it already? Oh, it's behind this tree. Um, oh god, he gelded the bear with one of his strikes. Um, okay. Black bear, regaining balance. Oh look, it's... <laughs> Whoops, it means to zoom there. There's the uh, little gelded symbol. Uh, poor bear. Well, it's unconscious anyway, so let's just kick it in the head. And uh, then actually get my weapons out. <laughs> And uh, let's try hitting it in the head with my mace. Tearing apart the muscle. I guess I'm just really not strong enough for this. Uh, bruising the skull. Yeah. I mean, I did put my strength up to high, but I'm a tiny little tortoise man, I think, so... Uh... Okay, I mean, it's unconscious, so let's just auto-attack it. Who got the kill? I did. Nice. Um, so, drink bear blood. Nice. All right. Uh, so where was I going? All right, so I'm going to go southeast. Avoid any rivers. Oh, we can't stop here. This is bear country. There's so many bears. What's going on? Huh? 
I just went behind that tree and then stayed there. Um, help? Alright, here we go. Oh god. Uh, the black bear's bitten the axeman in the hand. Um, so yeah, he's in trouble, because that's a big old bear. Uh, strike in the head with my mace, that's gonna hurt. Uh, so, I bruised his muscle. And he's charged at the human axeman and knocked him over. Uh, he's attacking him, I got a opportunity strike there on one of his paws, if I bite it, might as well. Bruising the bone, I've latched on firmly for some reason. Uh, wrestle using mouth, shake right paw. Yeah, take that. Okay, um, it's unconscious anyway, the, maze, the axe man must have done something. So, there we go. Bashed it in the head with my silver mace, and it's dead. Um, so yeah, did you lose any parts there? You've lost his shield. Um, I don't think he's going to pick that up again. Uh, let's see. Description. Right hand is torn open. Uh, can I look at, like... No, I guess I need... Yeah, I was just trying to see if it was like nerve damage or something, because um, if it's just a cut, it'll heal when we travel. Uh, da, 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 da. Give. I would like to give you your shield back. Copper shield. Uh, mark for trade. Give. There we go. Okay, hopefully they, um, I acquired something. How pleasurable. <laughs> okay. Well, here's some uh, stupid elf places right on the river, so I can cross there nice and easily. 